Hi, I'm the Mythology Guy, and you guys have been asking me to check out this new Percy Jackson teaser, so here I am. Got my shirt and everything, and uh, now it is just a teaser, so I'm not expecting a whole lot, but hopefully there will be at least, like, one cool thing in here. Um... So, uh, in, yes, I know about the casting, by the way, but I've held off on talking about that until I at least see something to do with the series. I think that's the fair thing to do. But, uh, regardless, um, let's see if Disney Plus can do what, um, I think it was Fox. Let's see if they can do what Fox couldn't. All right, let's have a look-see, dook -see, and ba-boom. Look. This is the camp, obviously. I didn't want to be a half -blood. Quoting the beginning Being of the book. But it's dangerous. Let's put that on. It's scary. Most of the time, it gets you killed. Okay. If oh, you think new kind of shirt. One of us. Okay. My advice is turn away while you still can. Of course. So now they can sell the new kind of shirt. Lie. Your mom or dad told you about your birth. Campers look Try pretty standard. Okay. Happens. Because once you know what you are. They'll sense it too. Looks a little small. Maybe they'll come for you. Okay. Don't say I didn't warn you. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. So that's it. Oh. Alright. <laughs> um. Okay, well, truth be told, that was kind of nothing overall <laughs> um but uh yeah let's let's take a look back see if there's anything i missed um <clears throat> so we got the campers here uh outfits look pretty normal we got i think those are spartan style shields honestly <laughs> i like this one over here with the that's a good representation of how the percy jackson world is you'll have some girl wearing just these modern normal glasses and then the armor all of a sudden <laughs> I like that. Uh, did, uh, I mean, this has got to be the Athena cabin, right? Because I assume this is supposed to be Annabeth, based on what I heard about the casting. Um, okay, well, let's see what else we got. We got an owl. That's probably also part of the Athena cabin. <laughs> and over here we got really nothing. Okay, we got the signs. Cool. And then we had a shot of... Yeah, here's the cabins. Okay. Do-do. Um, all right. Uh... Boom. Yeah, these cabins look kind of normal, but then the Poseidon cabin... This looks really small, doesn't it? I mean, I know he's the only son of Poseidon, but I thought they had all the cabins, like, the same size. Like, that's why the Hermes cabin is so cramped and crowded. I don't know, am I missing something? It almost looks like it completely stops right here and it's just a flat building. <laughs> I don't know. It's also all off by itself. That... That, that's sad. <laughs> shouldn't it be like... I, I thought they were all like lined up in like a U form. So shouldn't he still have some kind of neighbors? I don't know. And maybe, maybe I'm just remembering some things wrong. <clears throat> okay, well, I mean, overall, this... Uh, look, like, full... Uh, I was expecting something to happen here, but nothing happened here. <laughs> okay, well, overall... Um, I mean, look, it, it's cool to get a teaser and everything, but it, it didn't really change anything. Like, the only thing this teaser would reveal is there's a Percy Jackson show coming, and we already know that. That's the thing. We already know there's a Percy Jackson show coming. Like, it's not like this show... And we already knew about the casting, so that didn't really... It would have been cool if we had seen at least one little scene of, like, maybe a monster, like, just to close it out, or a god just to close it out. Like, because if you show us a monster, then we get an idea of what your effects are going to be like, and whether they're going to look good or not. If you show us a god, then we get to see something really unique, and we get a good idea of that. Or, I don't know, maybe you can show us a scene of, like, the lineup of the heroes, or, I don't know, but, uh... I don't know, this feels like the kind of teaser you would air when we don't know that the show is coming out, but we do, so nothing really changed. <laughs> Alright, um, <clears throat> all right. you've all been asking me to talk about it, so, and I said I'd wait until there was a teaser to talk about it. There's still really nothing to go off of, but I guess I'll talk about it a little. Um, okay, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you guys. I don't like that they race-swapped some of the characters, and let me tell you why. Um, 
I really, really love this book series, and I really would like to see it just come to life on the screen. Like, obviously that didn't happen with the movies. And, you know, I was really hoping it would really come to life uh, with this series, because Rick Riordan was heavily involved, and he said it was going to be so loyal to the books. Um, and then they race-changed some of the characters, and I was like, oh, okay. I mean, you know, it's like, we, we all, we have these things these ways we picture the characters and of course they're never going to look a hundred percent the way we imagine them but it would be nice if they looked as close as possible it's like we all collectively agreed that it was stupid that annabeth didn't have blonde hair in the first movie and well she's not gonna have blonde hair now so that's that's a little rough it, obviously it's not the actress's fault I, i'm sure this is a great actress i'm sure it'll still be fun i'll just always be a little bummed that she doesn't feel like annabeth from the books came to life and the kid playing percy seems fine um i i didn't get a good enough look at him and the one good look at him and we get is in black and white so like it's like i can't really judge like like i can't tell if his eyes are, are green or not i can't tell what color his hair is supposed to be so i can't really tell you anything about the percy like look um, he sounds okay, and I, I've heard he's a good actor, so that's cool. But yeah, I'm always going to be a little bummed that some of the characters didn't, like, don't feel like the character from the book alive on the screen. In the same way, like, if they ever do a Heroes of, Olymp of Olympus adaptation, I would expect Leo to be Mexican, I would expect Hazel to be black, I would expect Piper to be Native American, and I would expect Frank to be Asian, like... Because if any of them aren't that race, I'm going to be really annoyed, to be honest. I don't want White Hazel. I don't want Asian Leo. I don't want, like, Indian Frank. Like, come on. <laughs> like, I, I think we all want the characters to be the way they, you know, are supposed to be. It's like, kind of, I kind of go into this in the Gods of Egypt review that I'm currently working on. That's another movie that characters did not look the way they should have looked. Um... But I don't know, what do you think? Does it not matter to you, or does it matter to you? Oh, and by the way, this is not an invitation to go harass the actors on Twitter. If you do that, I don't like you. Don't do that. That's an idiotic thing to do. I heard some people were doing that. I was like, what is wrong with you? That is a child. Leave the freaking kid alone. <sighs> but yeah, I mean, I guess overall that's my thoughts on the series. I'm still, I'm still pretty hopeful that it'll be a lot of fun and stuff. Um, there are some things about it that I'm like, oh, but you know, uh, overall, like, still no, I don't see any big red flags or anything. I mean, this, like I said, the teaser didn't really show much. I'm really hoping it'll have some epicness to it. I know it's a TV budget, but it's also Disney. I mean, you know, Disney has the money to make things look cool. Even though they don't always, but hey, if you're gonna put all that effort into photorealism in remakes that nobody even likes, can you put some effort into this too, please? I, we'd all really like it, you know? <laughs> can you make the Minotaur look really good? <laughs> okay, well, yeah, I mean, there's really not much else to say. It's a 52-second teaser. What more do you want me to say? Most of the shots were just of trees and water. There's not much to say about that. Um, but yeah, I guess that's all I have to say. I'm the Mythology Guy, and I don't know how to end videos. Bye-bye.